Hi, now we're going to do another rational exponent problem. We have a fraction. Here's the numerator of the fraction. p to the negative one-fourth q to the negative four-thirds over the denominator which is 2 to the negative 1 half. No, it's not. It's 2 to the negative 1. p to the negative 3. q to the negative 1 fourth. Now this fraction has parentheses around it. and it is being raised to the negative third power. My goodness! There are a couple of ways I could work this, but notice that all of the rational powers, well all of the powers on the fraction are negative and the exponent on the outside of the parentheses is negative and remember that if we multiply negative times negative, we get positive. So I propose to, well, it's not really distribution, but it looks like distribution, so I'm going to say it. I propose to distribute the negative 3 on the outside of the parentheses to all of the powers on the inside of the parentheses. And it's important to say that the negative 3 is also a power. All right, here we go. Negative one-fourth times negative three is positive three-fourths. So in the numerator, I'll have p to the positive three-fourths. Negative four-thirds times negative three is going to be positive four. So I'll have q to the fourth power over Negative 1 times negative 3 is positive 3, so I'll have 2 to the third power on the bottom. In the denominator, I'll have 2 to the third power. Negative 3 times negative 3 is positive 9, so in the denominator, I'll have p to the positive 9. And negative 1 fourth times negative 3 is positive 3 fourths, so I'll have q to the positive three-fourths. Now let me read the entire fraction to you that I have right now. In the numerator, I have p to the three-fourths power, q to the fourth power. In the denominator, I have two to the third power, p to the ninth power, q to the three-fourths power. Now, This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to use the quotient rule. So since I have p to the three-fourths in the numerator and p to the ninth, ninth power in the denominator, in the numerator I'm going to write p to the three-fourths minus 9 power. And since I have q to the fourth power on top and q to the three-fourths power on the bottom, up in the numerator I'm going to write q to the four minus three-fourths. Meanwhile, in the denominator I have two to the third power, which is eight. So now I have to either use a calculator or by hand figure out what 3 fourths minus 9 is and I don't have my calculator right now so I'm going to do it by hand but you can use your calculator. 3 fourths minus 9 is going to be 3 fourths minus 36 fourths 
and that's going to equal negative 33 fourths. And I'm going to calculate what 4 minus 3 fourths is. That will be 16 fourths minus 3 fourths. And that will be 13 fourths. Okay, so my fraction so far is P to the negative 33 fourths times Q to the 13th fourth, that's in the numerator, all over 8. Now notice that P is raised to a negative power. We're going to take the P term and move it to the denominator where its power will become positive. So my final answer is going to be Q to the 13 fourths power in the numerator over 8 times P to the positive 33 fourths power. Okay, meditate on that for a while and I'll talk to you later.